here I have a totally reversible garment, so I'm going to make a headband. I'm using two different colored yarns, an ivory and a darker beige, and a two-ended crochet hook so that I can work from two different directions. So that's all you need for this project. So now, since we already loaded it up with the beige, we're going to turn it and start working with one side of the hook that has the white yarn. You're always going to work with the color of yarn that isn't already loaded up on the crochet hook. So the beige is loaded up, and now we're going to work down with the white. And on the first one, you just loop over and pull through the first loop on the crochet hook. Then you yarn over and pull through two, and you continue yarning over and pulling through two until you complete the entire row. So here it goes. I won't make you watch the whole thing. And it gets faster. Okay, so we're getting towards the end. You're going to notice that that last loop on the hook is going to be loose, but that's okay because we're going to tighten it up when we turn it and start up the next, the next row. So don't worry about that last one. Now you're going to load back up in the color you were working on. We want to get it back on the double-ended crochet hook by just going through the vertical stitch in the front that's in beige, again the contrasting color, and load it up with your white that you were just working with. And once it's loaded back up, we will work down again with the, well, rotate it, turn it, and work down with the opposite color again. Now, when we get to the very end, it's important to see that last color at the end in the beige. Make sure that that one also gets looped up back onto the crochet hook. Then you have your white loaded up, and we're going to want to turn it. And again, that one on the end is going to be loose. You tighten it up and then work back down in the contrasting color. We're going to yarn over, pull through one to kind of lock it in place, and then yarn over and pull through two, and we'll continue to yarn over and pull through two until we complete that contrasting color. And then again, remember that one on the end is always going to be a little bit loose, but it's okay because we'll tighten it up when we alternate colors. And that is the two kind of reversible panel, I'm going to turn it into an ear warmer or headband.